Hey, what's going on everyone? It's I'm Zane, I'm Impossible Legacy, back with another video. I'm really sorry I haven't been uploading lately, and I'm sorry that the Crazy Craft series got cut short. If you guys were enjoying that, then I'm sorry about that. But today we're bringing you guys some more Pokemon content. We're gonna be moving into more Pokemon stuff. Right now we're gonna be starting the series Ash Gray version, which I'm not really sure when that will all be posted, but... This is the first episode of that, we're going to be starting the journey. And then we also have a Pokemon card opening coming this week. It's not going to be that big, but it's going to be fun at least. I guess let's just get into this. The various patterns will be explained in the audio of the importance. Who's the main? Okay. Yeah, I... You are a boy from Palatown. Now that you are 10, you can get your Pokemon license. 10-year-olds can get a beginner Pokemon from Professor Oak, the town's Pokemon expert. This is just the beginning of your amazing adventures. Your journey is destined to be packed with non-stop action, millions of laughs, heart-pounding perils, and endless excitement. You'll encounter fantastic friends, evil enemies, and meet creatures bound your wildest imagination. And as your story unfolds, you'll unlock the magic and mystery of the world Pokemon. There's Professor Oak. Hello there. Glad to meet you. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People affectionately refer to me as the Pokemon Professor. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are pets. Others use them for battle battling. As for myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. I hear you want to catch and train Pokemon. Yikes. Hmm. <coughs> and there's me. Let's begin with your name. What is it? We're gonna go with Zane. Actually, we're gonna stay true to the anime. Let's go Ash. Actually, now nah, we're gonna do the Japanese name, Satoshi. It's also the creator of Pokemon, if you did not know. I think I spelled it right. This is my grandson. He's been your, your rival since you both were babies. And what was his name now? S H I G Oh, whoops. E Are you? I think. There we go. I don't know why his face is so red. Your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go. Oh. Let's change it to my PJs. Yes. And then before we go to bed. It's a live Pokemon match on TV. Gengar versus Nidorino. Whoops, better get going. Alright, let's go to bed. Of course. Raising Bul Bulbasaur, that'd be really simple. It's perfect for beginners. And then there's Squirtle. Choose it or lose it. Oh, hold on. Charmander. Those in the know say that's the best way to go. Ugh. If it was restless, then... I'm late. Didn't he break it in the anime? I, th I think he broke it. Oh, Satoshi, you woke up late, didn't you? you better hurry. Professor Oak next door will be expecting you. Oh, my bad. Okay. For someone who's late, I'm walking at a very slow pace. Alright. Hey, watch where you're going. Oh, you must be Satoshi. Better late than never, I guess. Well, Satoshi, you snooze, you lose. And you're way behind... Right from the start. I've got a Pokemon and you don't, and I got the best one. It pays to have a grandfather in the Pokemon business. Now I, Shigeru Oak, am off to learn the ways of the Pokemon trainer. See you later, Satoshi <laughs> boy. Yikes. That's a name to say. Okay. Professor. Professor, I'm here. What? Why do I have permit? Professor, I need my Pokemon so I can get on my Pokemon adventure. So, so, Satoshi, you decide to show up after all. You want a Pokemon, eh? From the looks of it, you aren't ready for Pokemon training. Da, 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 da. So, hmm, so you say you're ready. Alright, then, as you wish. Alright. Let's get our Pokemon, boys. I wish I had another slip, but now I will. Choose this my Pokemon. Bulbasaur. Is this the Pokemon you want? Yes. What? That one was taken by a kid who wasn't late. Dude. You better have a Pokemon for me. Well, that's their problem, because my Pokemon will be Charmander. Is this the Pokemon you want? Yes. 
the early bird gets the rainbow. In this case, the Pokemon. Ugh, dude. Fine. I've thought about it a lot. It took me a long time, but I finally decided to choose Squiddle. Is this... Is that the Pokemon you want? Squiddle's already been taken by someone who's on time. Professor, where's all the Pokemon? I need a Pokemon. Plus, yes, all the story Pokemon I had have been given away to trainers who were on time. Well, there's one left. I think I should warn you that there is a problem with this last one. Its name is Pikachu. Will you try to train this electric mouse type? What happens if I say no? One sec. Oh. Well, guess I can go back to bed and dream about my starter. Uh, rip. I guess we'll try and train Pikachu, guys. I mean, I would rather have a Clefairy, but... I guess. Um, let's name him. Um, we'll just name him... We'll name him X-Ray. Just cause, why not? There we go. It's also known as the electric mouse. It's usually shy, but can sometimes have an electrifying personality. Shocking, isn't it? That was so bad. Now take these, your Pokedex and Pokeballs. Receive the Pokedex and five Pokeballs from Professor Oak. The Pokedex automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. You can't get detailed data on Pokemon by just seeing them. You must catch them using your Pokeballs to obtain complete data. Of course. When a wild Pokemon appears, it's fair game. Just throw a Pokeball at it and try to catch it. This won't always work out. A healthy Pokemon can escape. You have to be lucky. Good luck, Satoshi. Your Pikachu is sure to be a handful. There's no time like the present, though. Get going and start training that Pikachu. Alright. Let's get it, boys. I was checking something. Oh, hey, Mom. I'm glad, Satoshi, I'm glad I caught you. I'm so proud of you. You're finally fulfilling your dream. You're starting your journey as a trainer, but I also miss you so much. I brought you some traveling items. Those are your running shoes. I. Satoshi switched shoes with the running shoes. Press the B button to run, but the only way those rooms run. Hmm, that's your Pokemon? I thought all Pokemon stayed inside their Pokeballs. Why doesn't this one? It's a little weird. Hmm, oh well, good luck, Satoshi, and don't forget to change your own you know what every day. I know you have to get going. I love you. I, today I embark on my journey as a trainer. Satoshi Tajiro? I think his last name is. Starts with like a T. Alright. Root one. Let's go, Pikachu. A Pidgey has appeared. Go, Pikachu. Pika? Pikachu. Oh, Pika- Dude. I can't be a trainer if you don't listen to me, Pikachu. I need to catch these Pokemons. Uh, Pikachu. Dude. Pikachu, you better catch the spirit for me. I'm gonna be very sad if you don't. Yeah, let's go, X-Ray. Fight. Use Thunder Shock, X-Ray. Dude, stupid for connect me. I might have to run. This is some scary territory. Alright, yikes. Nice. Good job, Xray. What what happens if I catch the spear? Can I catch the spear? Let's try and catch the Spearow, guys. Oh. Oh. Let's go. We caught a Spearow, guy. Yeah. Let's go. Easy Spearow catch. Give a nickname. Ikari. Dude, I caught... Oh, as it was captured? Dude, it knows I caught it. I gotta go. Oh, yeah. Satoshi grabbed Pikachu and made a run for it. I gotta go, dude. Scoot, scoot. Scoot, scoot. Alright. Let's get out. Oh, no. Is it a Spearow? Dude, I already have a Spearow. I gotta go. Okay. This will be a good experience for Xray, though. Hopefully, he'll listen to me. Oh, my gosh. <sighs> dude, Xray is just bullying me. 
extra you got you gotta you gotta you gotta get the spirit for me <sighs> thank you yeah. i'm not really sure how far this game goes so this might be a really long series but yeah hopefully now that it's summer i can actually start posting more but all right so what you do is you come up here and then you just and then you can swim in the water i actually did not know this until recently hey kid i've tried to fish oh is that pokemon is it hurt you need to get your pikachu to pokemon center right away that's a hospital for pokemon there's one in viridian city hey wait a minute kid that's my bike bye i'm sorry misty wait i wonder what happens if we go back and talk to you Hey, give me, kid, give me back my bicycle. Dude, I literally came back to talk to you. Why are you still fishing, too? Like, it's like you don't care about your boat. The wild spear won't let you pass. Satoshi sent Pikachu to its Pokeball to protect it. Spears, do you know who I am? I'm Satoshi from the town of Palette. I'm destined to be the world's number one Pokemon master. I can't be defeated by the likes of you. I can just imagine him turning his hat around. Right, I don't actually own any of those. Credit goes to the people who made those. Thank you for that. Use Thunder Shock on the attacking spear. Let's go, Pikachu. Thanks for the help, buddy. And there's Ho, this beautiful thing. And then they made like a movie on what would happen if Ash actually went after it, which is Pokemon I Choose You, I believe. What happens if I keep going straight? Nothing. Yeah, I ripped the bicycle though. All right. Okay. Foodie and City. Hey, you. Where did you get that Pokemon from? Oh, that's your Pokemon? I'm sorry, but I have to be on the lookout for thieves. Your Pokemon's in bad shape. Here, let me show you where the Pokemon Center is. Dude, I want to ride on her motorbike. Like, rip. This just, yeah. This looks so cool, though. This is Pokemon Center. You can heal your injured Pokemon here. Good luck. Why can't I move until she leaves, dude? It's like I watch her out. <laughs> hey, now I've got you. I knew I'd find you here. And look what you did to my bike. It was destroyed by lightning when you stole it. You'll pay for this someday, kid. Yeah, not today though. Alright guys, so we're not actually gonna be using like the original Kanto team. Like we will once we get all of them, but we're also gonna be using other Pokemon until we get them all. Oh no. <laughs> uh, don't be frightened, little boy. Allow us to introduce ourselves. To protect the world from devastation, to unite all people within our nation, to denounce the evils of truth and love, to extend your reach to the stars above. I'm not I'm not saying any more of this. This is the only time I'll ever say that. I'm sorry. Holy mackerel. What a meme. Okay. okay, Pikachu. It's up to you. Yeah. No, I don't need your... No, sure. No, sure. I don't need your help. Yeah. Um, also, I'm not really sure what other series I should do. I'm going to be doing a lot more Pokemon series, but I'm also going to be continuing my Minecraft stuff. Hopefully, at least. And hopefully some CSGO videos will be coming soon. I'm, I haven't tried recording any lately. Because I, I, I have been playing a lot of CS lately, but I haven't tried recording any. So. One sec, let me skip this song. This is a really, it's a good song, but I just don't want to listen to it right now. That, the song I just switched to, great song. You guys should all go listen to it. It's by Jeremy Camp, Dead Man Walking. It, 10 out of 10. I'll have a link to my entire playlist in the description if you guys want it. I'm gonna, actually, can I even switch out Pikachu? I'm gonna switch out Pikachu to Spirit just in case. Alright, let's go anger. Oh, I did. Where even is. Does it just not show up if it's not a traditional Pokemon that Ash catches? Why is Pikachu there? What is happening? I, dude, I actually don't know what's happening. <laughs> why does it. Why does it say X rays in? Alright. Let's go. Good job, Akari. 
Oh, you did it. If you win, you win prize money and your Pokemon will be up. But G-Mark remove won't give up that easily. No matter. Now, now let's deal with Sunday's Pokemon. Pikachu appeared from its Pokeball. That measly Pikachu can't stop Team Rocket. Pikachu used Thunder Shock. Thanks, Steven. P Thanks, Pikachu. Let's go catch some more Pokemans. Okay. A Caterpie. I will catch you as the future Pokemon master of the world. It's my duty. The Thunder Shock. You don't know who you're messing with, Caterpie. Let's get it. Go Pokeball. Two. One. Yes. That's our third Pokemon. Let's go. Alright, so he gets two Pokemon here and then he gets the starters. And that's all the Pokemon he catches. He also catches Krabby, but um so we got Chow. Hopefully this is like a Pidgey or something. I'm gonna catch it, but I don't know. I don't like Beedrill as much as I like Butterfree. I think that's a lot of people, but. I'm gonna like kill this one for EXP. Nice. Alright. I mean, faint it. Sorry, my bad. I would never kill a Pokemon. Only faint. <sighs> oh, another Weedle. Level 4. The early parts probably are going to be a bit boring. Mostly because I'm the one doing it. But that's besides the point. Easy roast. Dang, Weedles, dude. Oh, well, they're good experience, at least. Thunder Shock. Hmm. Don't poison me, don't poison me, don't poison me. Thank you. Oh, this one survived. Alright. Let's catch it, then. Might as well. One. Two. Three. Caught. Let's go. As you guys can see, I do not know Japanese, but they have cool names, so. Another dang Weedle dude. Alright, let's kill X Ray. I did not mean to use that. If I get poisoned now, I'm actually gonna be sort of mad. It's gonna poison. For a second, I thought it was going to be a crit and poison, and I was going to be very upset. Alright. Once we get to Pewter City, I'm going to end this episode. I might do two today, and then just try and make up for the two weeks I think I missed. Which I'm very sorry about, actually. But, uh. Like, stop with the flipping Weedles. Let's kill these this weedle. I mean, knock it out. We don't kill. It's a good Christian Minecraft channel. I can't kill, so. No crit, no poison. Nice. Worst comes to worst, we use Um Spear. Oh my gosh. Oh, Kajiro. There you are. Level 7. Alright. Actually, I might die right away. Hopefully, I get, like, paralyzed off or something. Okay, that's, that's fine. That's fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're okay. 
and paralysis. That's gonna kill Pikachu. Alright, thank you, Pikachu. Let's go, Spiro. Let's go, Pokeball. Hopefully, we catch it. Ah, uh, what the? Pidgeotto, you literally. And it did nine. What the flip? This Pidgeotto is freaking nuts. This Pidgeotto is freaking nuts, dude. That's my last Pokeball, or else I guess I'm gonna just have to kill it. Come on, come on. Yes! Let's go, dude. Here's my last Pokeball, too. What should we name Pidgeotto? Ah, uh, the bug catcher guy. No, I'm not lost. I know, if I was lost, then there wouldn't be a designated path. Okay. Let's go, Ikari. I don't like that they don't have, like, actual, like... If this poisons me, I'm gonna be sad. So it only does 3 damage. So I should be able to win this. Okay. Was there a speed tie or something? Maybe Poison's thing has like... I don't know. Probably was a speed tie or something. Okay, Kari's level 7. This is the break. Okay, oh, whoops. I, I don't need a break. Level Pikachu up. Oh my gosh. That's not... Bruh. This kid. Why don't they just shoot me or something? I don't know. Oh, double battle? You mess with it. X-Ray and Akari. Let's beat them. Any? The first dragon I get, I'm naming Ryujin, by the way. It means Dragon God, I believe. Thunder. Use Thunder Shock. X-Ray. I'm gonna have to switch out, Ikari. Alright, let's just spam AA. That hits both of us? That's stupid. Holy freaking mackerel. Oh well, the static. Static should come in handy at least. Go. Send out Nihon. Actually, Neon was probably not the best choice to send out. We can at least maybe do a little damage with him. Can you poison a poison type? I thought there was a way you could. I thought that you just kind of toxic them. That barely did anything. That's gonna kill. Yeah. The flip is this coughing, dude. Alright, let's go, Sora. Which I get that, you should be able to kill the. That's some good damage, though, even if it was a crit. Alright, good job. Gonna use tackle. Holy. Can at least get some good damage. Probably gonna kill Ikari, but that's okay. Hopefully, Kaido people get some good XP and maybe a vault. Come on. Let's go. Holy. I'm honestly gonna run back to that girl. Probably not level 7. I might just stay here for a bit and just train. Actually, this episode is really long. <laughs> I'm gonna train off screen, get uh, everyone up to like level maybe 15. Because I have nothing super effective against the rock gym. Let's finish out this episode a bit at least. I want to make it to at least Beauty City. If that takes us to 45 minutes, then so be it. But I'm getting us to Pewter City at least. Flip, dude. Weedle, level 5. I want Extra 8 to be. Yeah. I want all my Pokemon to be high level. Oh my gosh, the poison, dude. Can this thing die? Alrighty. Oh, X-Ray, don't die. We will win this fight, but we actually have to go back and get healed again. This is very annoying. I wish I could just edit, but 
I want to show you guys everything. And I'm only gonna, yeah. I'm not gonna try, I'm gonna try not to do very much off screen except for training stuff. Honestly, let's just push forward. We're gonna switch you for, we're gonna just have Sora soar us through these battles quick. That's not, you don't really look like the samurai. Polo Pincer. Sora should be able to take this out. Bruh. You think you're cool? You're not cool. I can tell you that much right now. Boy, maybe three hit. Gosh, this pincer is annoying, dude. Doesn't he have like a metapod too? Wasn't he supposed to send Metapod out first? That's what I thought. Freaking course, because of the focus energy. How am I not faster than this guy, dude? You know what would suck? If I just exited out of this tab and forgot to save. Holy mackerel. So I just soared to level 10 and 11. Good job, Sora. Well, I don't have to do as much training with Sora then. Probably should have switched. Sora's gonna just kill this thing. Good job, Sora. You didn't actually kill it. Because now we're just gonna switch to someone who needs the EXP. Whoops, that's not Pokemon. Nihon, lowest level Pokemon so far, so. gonna run I guess. Go get Chow. Get Chow. Some XP too. Alright, oh, that's not as bad. So we got three of our Pokemon XP. Quick, get to my cabin. Actually I might just stop at the cabin. But you proved to be only a novice. Now guess your Pokemon and leave my cabin. Okay, goodbye. If you're just gonna insult my Pokemon, then I have no business left to attend with you. Did you see that bee just swim? I could hear the buzzing all the way from here. Bruh, I was there. I was the reason for that bee just swim. Also, if you guys want to see like a Pokemon Tower Defense or something, I have done a lot of that, so... Like, I beat a lot of it, but I will replay it for this channel if you guys want to see that. It's going to be a lot of Pokemon stuff right now. And I'm also going to do a randomizer soon. Like, I have everything needed for it, I just haven't gotten around to it. So, I was thinking Sinnoh, probably, because that's where I started my entire Pokemon adventure. So, it's probably going to be Sinnoh. Why haven't you evolved yet? He's already fast. Why? This kid, dude. I think we do about the same damage. Maybe not. Okay. Well, if he's just gonna keep using string shot, then. People these days, dude. Metapod. I, okay, I did say no. <sighs> Hopefully we can get there today, at least. Hopefully. <laughs> Alright, I'm just gonna switch to... I, I did not mean to do that. <laughs> Like, I, I, I meant to click on it, but I didn't think... I forgot that I was in a browser. <laughs> My bad. I'll try and edit it out. Try. Kiwi, try. Well, guys, we're gonna get our first evolution, at least, this episode. Are you ready? Oh, dude, Chow is evolving into a cocoon. Uh, no, a cocoon, no. A cocoon. I think that's what it's called. Dude, I have not taken, like, I have not studied anything about butterflies for a while, so. 
Uh, Chow learned hiding, the best move. Still not Peter City? Okay, there's Peter City. Let's get to the Pokemon Center and then end this. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And I'll catch you guys next time. See you guys. Thanks for playing. <laughs>